tonight, we're hearing from a friend of the woman who was hit and killed by an alleged street racer last week on Southeast Powell. The crash happened Thursday night. It left three people dead, the driver and passenger of the speeding car and a woman. Fox Falls Chandler Watkins has the story of how she's being remembered tonight. We talked every day. We texted on the regular, and it's devastating to even think you know that there's not another day that Jules is going to text me in the morning and say, hey, did you watch Love Island? Jody King says she met Julie Skeen in high school, and the two have been friends ever since. Love my life, that girl. You know, I mean, if you met her, you'd never not talk to her again. She was just that person that made you feel so good and laugh so hard when you were with her that you wanted to spend more time with her. King says last Thursday, Skeen was doing her last door dash of the day with her husband, turning on to Southeast Powell in Portland when a car police say was racing another car hit them. Skeen was taken to the hospital where she later died. It's been torture. I have never felt something like this in my entire life. and. I don't know how you get over it. King says everyone who knew Skeen is devastated, including her husband, Justin, who survived the crash. It's going to be a big hole. You know, it's big for me. It's big for him. It's big for a lot of us. King says to help pay for medical expenses and to lay her friend to rest, she started a GoFundMe. We lost a great human being, a fabulous human being that, that gave to the world, mentored kids, didn't have to be this way, and we could still have Jules with us. And we don't. We have a link to that GoFundMe on kptv.com. Reporting in Tillamook, Chandler Watkins, Fox 12, Oregon.